Americans, would you be in support of putting a law in place that government officials, such as senators and the president, go without pay during shutdowns like this while other federal employees do? Why or why not? At face value, I would think it's a good idea, but I saw someone pointed out a rather logical reason why it wouldn't, basically the wealthier representatives could wait out the poorer ones. Worse yet, the representatives whose lobbyists have the bigger pockets can keep them afloat. I'd rather change the law so that not passing the budget defaulted to a continuing resolution. There is no reason a shutdown should happen. I don't think the whole shutdown concept should even exist. Budgets for projects with limited lifetimes should end, but operating budgets for ongoing departments and agencies should run along as is until changed. There should never be a budget no budget conflict. It should be about how much we spend or don't spend on each individual thing. I support a law that ends shutdowns by continuing funding at previous levels if no new budget is passed. Although a very different situation, from what I understand this is pretty much how it is happening in Northern Ireland and they haven't had a government in over a year. I'd be more in favor of holding an impromptu election like other countries do. If a Congress can't work together to keep the government open at a minimum, why not re-vote and whoever the public decides is the problem gets thrown out? The cost of voting to shut down the government should be the calling of new elections. No. Corrupt politicians would have advantage over honest ones. Honest ones might find it easier to get money illegitimately than to solve the shutdown problem, which corrupt politicians would love. Are you implying that the ones with more money are corrupt? After all, Nancy Pelosi is worth well over $100 million. I'm generally in favor of the idea that Congress should be bound by every law it passes. They get to use the things they pass for the rest of us, health care, the retirement, hiring practices, etc. No exceptions for the special people. No, because this whole process is fucking stupid and shouldn't have to happen in the first place. If they can't pass a budget, last year's budget should roll over and take its place. This crap is ridiculous. The president should have to vacate the White House during a shutdown and be sequestered in a Motel 6 with Congress until everything is solved. Everyone has to share beds. The government shouldn't even be shut down in the first place. There should be a law that just rolls over the previous year's budget if an agreement can't be reached on a new one. President isn't accepting his pay, been donating it quarterly. We don't need a law, we need lawmakers who will put parties aside and work for the people. Guess being a jackass and a fatty are more important than being American. I would support it, I don't think it would have much effect. Most senators, certainly this president, aren't working check to check. They're far more beholden to their donors that are behind their agenda. Sure, but the current president already doesn't take any pay unlike Congress or the Senate. Also force them to work, no recess vacation, until a shutdown is ended. More importantly, I think we should focus on forcing them to make term limits a law. It needs to be something different, like the lawmakers being unable to leave D.C. during shutdown. Not getting paid would just create a false sense of equality when you know the senators and representatives wouldn't even blink an eye. I would first like to see a law limiting House and Senate term limits. It would hopefully get rid of lifelong politicians in favor of people who want to make a difference and have their voice felt in the limited time they're in there. A better law would be that last year's budget becomes the default until a new one is passed. Or Congress cannot recess until a budget is passed. Absolutely not because wealthy senators could use the shutdown to pressure senators who actually need that pay to vote the way they want. Better yet, would you be in support of a system like those in Australia and Britain where if a government cannot pass a budget within two weeks, it is forced to go to election? This way, public servants are never forced to go without pay. What a fucking circle jerk, attention-seeking question. As if you don't know exactly what Americans of Reddit think about the shutdown and their politicians. No, I don't want my congressman woman casting a vote because they need their paycheck. 
In Canada, during rare government shutdowns all government staff are paid, except the politicians. No. Most members of Congress can easily survive without pay as they're all millionaires, for the most part. Not only would it not affect them, but they would also be able to use that as a bargaining chip for poorer Congress members. Was it for the Articles of Confederation or Constitution that they just locked them all in a room and told them to fuck off until they figured it out? I vote that.